welcome back to my channel if you are new welcome to my channel my name is Dee Dee thank you so much for stopping by and hanging out with me if you are not new welcome back to my channel thank you so much so I'm going to be sharing today with you guys my April 2021 ipsy bag now my daughter I did recently sign her up for this and um she has not gotten hers and when we checked it last said that she would not get hers till May 6th which will already be into the new month um because I did want to start doing them where her and I unbox them together but unfortunately I figured I would go ahead and just do mine now because that I'm not going to get it anytime soon well she's not going to get it anytime soon excuse me so um this is my ipsy bag I do get the ipsy glam plus it is $25 plus tax a month which averages to about $27 and some change um, I did do a couple add-ons this month. I did get a free item with some points, so I will just share all of that with you. So um, let's go ahead and see if it has a card. It is, the theme this month is Force of Nature. Whether you love your naked face, feel naked or feel naked without your red lipstick, do what feels natural to you. When confidence is the first step, step in your routine, you can't be stopped. That is what it looks like right there. And it just has inside some superfoods to try and what they're good for and all of that. Um, and then it just talks about the Glam Bag X um, that will be coming out in May. Um, it's going to be Khloe Kardashian's uh, world from her go-to products. And it says... Um, Basically, you need to get on a waiting list. I think I am on a waiting list for this. Um, it is $55. You get eight full-size favorites, and you get to choose three of them, worth up to $529. So because my bag is $25, um, I would be charged an additional $25 for this bag if I am able to get it and get off the waiting list. I will do my bag first, and then we will go into the add-ons and the free points perk that I got. Um, this is what the bag looks like. It is okay. It's not my favorite. I don't care for these drawstring bags. However, I have been using them when I gift friends and stuff items. I've just been filling it up with different things. So that has been very handy for me. So I would definitely do that again with this one as well. The things I got in my bag are from Mask Maskology. And I got two of the Hyaluronic Gummy Modeling Mask Intensive Moisturizing and Firming Action with Hydrating, Firming, Brightening. It includes a mixing tray, Hyaluronic Gel, um, Step 1, Activating Power, and Spatula Powder, not Power. That is what it looks like. I did get two of these. Um, it says mix it yourself modeling mask goes on like jelly and peels off like gummy for intense hydration and firmer skin definitely excited to try that that is something different and unique that i have not ever used before so there's the first thing that's the first thing i got i believe ipsy chose that for me ipsy also chose this for me this is the rescue butter lemon superfood all-in-one um it looks like it's a multi-use balm moisturizer. It says here, apply to dry or cracked areas such as lips, elbows, and heels. Um, you can also use it as a cleanser. Uh, it says massage a generous amount through your face while avoiding the eyes. Gently wipe with a cotton pad or cloth and then rinse. That's pretty interesting. So yeah, I'll probably use it more for a lotion. I'll read more into this. Um, let's just see if it has a little, it does have a little thing, so I'm not going to, um, but it says it's an all-in-one. That's kind of cool. You can use it as a balm, a moisturizer, um, as a treatment. It says apply to dry or cracked areas. Um, and then it says you can use it as a cleanser. So we'll definitely try it in all those aspects. That's kind of interesting. Okay, the next item that Ipsy chose for me is this palette from Belle in Argent, I believe is what it's called. This is Nude Intuitive Vision. It's a eyeshadow palette. 
and um, I had not even paid attention to what Ipsy had chosen for me, unfortunately. And so um, I had seen this palette and I did want it and I wasn't sure I was going to get it because I didn't realize that they were putting it in the box. Um, it is a very reflective palette, so I don't mean to blind you guys. It's a silver, very pretty, um, sleek, and this is what it looks like right there. Very pretty, just neutral shades, and I did not know that they had sent me this, and I used some of my points for the palette, um, which I was going to show you guys. I wish it's here. So I would now have two, so I would probably gift one to a friend. Um, I don't know that I'll save it for a giveaway. Um, I did get this thanks to Ipsy, but I do have a second one here that I did use points for because I was not aware that I was going to be getting it. So I did get two of those. Um, so there's that. And then these are the three items I chose in my bag. This is from Naked Cosmetics, and um, it says, let's see. It looks like that. I don't know what it is that I picked. I forget. Oh, I remember now. It's a whole set. It comes like this. Very cute. Now I remember. I did pick this. You get four different pigments. And I'm not going to break it open as of yet. But that is what they look like. They're different pigments and different colors and little containers. Very cute. I did pick this. The only reason I picked it is because everything else was mostly skincare. I have so much skincare, it's ridiculous. So I figured this would probably be my best option since I don't have a ton, a ton of pigments and thought I would give it a try. And then I did pick the Honest Beauty Everything Cream Foundation Buildable Coverage in the color cream. It says it's buildable coverage, a velvety finish, and seamless blendability. That's the Honest Beauty of our Demi, Demi Matte Cream foundation formulated with moisturizing jojoba oil, vitamin E, and the pigments that blend smooth and evenly. Evenly. Again, I got mine in the color cream. And hopefully I picked a good match for me. Definitely excited to give this a try. And that is what it looks like. I think it said it. Yeah, it is cream. Just wanted to feel what it looked like. Off the first... I think it is going to match me very nicely. At first it kind of looked powdery, so that's kind of neat. So there's that there. I'm excited for that. Last thing that I chose was the Vita Bird C12 Dual Drop Serum Age Define and Deep Hydration. A blend of Vita Bird CG and peptides reduces signs of aging and brightens skin tone while providing deep hydration. It is a one fluid ounce. Right there. I almost feel like I've tried this before. It looks like right there. Can you not? So let me show you guys quickly the add-ons that I did. So um, I did, they had this little, I don't know if it was a winter or spring bag. I don't know what to call it, but this is the bag here and it came with stuff inside. I did pick up this Koki Cover and Conceal Beauty Sponge. You guys know that I love trying beauty sponges, so I can tell you guys if they are any good or anything like that. I have not tried anything from the brand Koki that I'm familiar with, and so I have heard a lot of great things about this brand. It does feel really, really soft through the packaging, so I'm really excited to have this. I believe it was $3. If I can find the actual price, like if you got it from Koki or like wherever Koki sold, which I think is Target, maybe CVS, I will let you know how much that is. I also picked up this brush here. Um, this is from... Bay Gotchis, I believe. Maybe I'm pronouncing it wrong. It's a concealer perfecting brush. It looks like that. Very, very pretty and very soft. And it just kind of has like that inner part that you can go in underneath the eyes and get perfectly. So I'm excited to give that a try. And now let's get into the bag. I believe this was $14. Maybe. I can't remember. Um... Definitely don't feel like it was worth it. Actually, hold on. Actually, these came with the this bag here. I'm sorry. Disregard. It was not with my Ipsy Glam bag. It was with this little bag here that I purchased. Um, so you got the two masks. 
and then they sent me a uh, cute cute I can't pronounce this a nail polish um, and it's in the color does it say let me show you what the box looks like I definitely don't need any more nail polishes um, I have so many I barely even use um, it is a very pretty color I will probably pass this on to someone who could use it on camera it's coming off like a red but it's more of like a fruit punch but the kind of toned down um, shade to it so this I will either save for a gift for someone or get pass it on to a family member there's that they did send a RCO waterfall moisture shine lotion for the hair um, I guess you just put it in after you get out the shower with your wet hair and apply it and it's just going to give some shine I do like this brand of product so this will be great for travel just to throw in your hair so I'm not too mad about that. And then they sent the Laboratories Filagora. Phil, Phil, I cannot pronounce anything today. Hydra Filler. Uh, this is a mo Pro Youth Moisture Care. Uh, it doesn't say anything else about it on there, so I'm not sure exactly what that is. I will look more into it. Most likely I will pass this on to my daughter. And then they sent me the Superhero Elastic Stretch Volumizing Mascara in a travel size. It does look like this. Always like having travel size mascaras. Um, and I have tried this. I really do enjoy it because I can just throw them in my purse. And when I go, I can just have it with me. So that's not too bad. I believe a trial size of that's like $13 to $14. So I guess that was the price of my bag. Um, not too happy. I thought it was going to have some better things in it, but I mean, what can you do? You know, they're kind of surprises. And so, um, I am excited about the mascara, um, and as well as the hair product and these masks. I think that that was a, okay. Um, these two, not so much. Um, I could have done without and like I said, I'll be passing these along and the bag is very cute So happy to have that it does have this little leaf right here So they're okay. It's so much for watching I really do appreciate each and every one of you if you did enjoy this I would love for you to give it a thumbs up Let me know if we got something the same this month if you were happy with your um, Items or not or your bag that you did receive. I'd love to hear that um, but thank you guys again for watching. If you're not subscribed, of course, I would love for you to go ahead and subscribe if you'd like to. And if not, no worries. But I will see you guys. This is going to complete. This will complete this video for today. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.